Bonjour. Hello, everyone. Welcome to our channel. Today we will speak about top 10 best-selling fragrances in our store for last month. Month. Which is April. Yeah. 2023. Mm. Okay. Number 10, mango skin. Oh, mango skin. By, by really high parfumery. This is like over sweet mango, but not like a ripe mango. Soon we will get dirty mango from Richard, and that will be really, really good mango. And I'm pretty sure they will be in top ten. But this one is a. It's like strong, strong mango. Sweet. I have, for me, it's like green mango with a lot of sugar. Uh, like green. I mean, like not ready to eat. Like. Mm. Manga that you can buy in any grocery store here in Canada because we don't have like really good one manga from Th Thailand. And I feel like something powdery, you know, like um, I can't describe it. Like it's like sharp something, you know? Yeah. Yeah. What uh, What do you guys say about the season? Of I would say spring, winter, spring, more spring. I, I I wouldn't say it's too summer because it's too sweet. It's like like it's over sweet. I can, you know, I can wear it for summer because okay. I, I, I can feel some like freshness, you know, fr of, from the fruit. Okay. Yeah. What for about gender? This one is like kind of unisex, but slightly on the feminine side. But uh, still, in general, it's unisex. Okay. Occasion. Not every day. It's so sweet. Maybe you have to go in the evening. Yeah, you know? I can feel the evening. This um, poisonous sweetness from the fragrance. This uh, kind of irresistible vibes for kind of sexy. Yep. Will you wear it? Somewhere? Because I, because I smell the dirty mango <laughs> and <laughs> I know what is dirty mango and I know how really sweet mango. I've been in Thailand so many times. That one is definitely not my perfume. It's a good one. It's not true mango. <laughs> but it's not true mango for me. Yeah, but this one is nice, but not mine. So. Because I just was doing editing uh, for our video when we compare Herbapura with uh, It's not Herbapura. Herbapura. Yeah, I know. I know. It's, so. it's the same brand. I mean Herbapura with different fragrances. Yeah. And we spoke about, remember, the juice, like the powder of juice, like you could invite something. Oh, yeah, yeah, like, yeah, yeah. And it smells like so like... Something toxic. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Something not natural. Yeah. Something not chemical. I don't want to say this word, but it's kind of uh, like something produced on a factory, I would say. So, yeah, for me... Not like coffee addict. Uh, so, yeah, yeah. So, realistic. so, wait for our review of Dirty Mango. When we receive Dirty Mango in two weeks... Dirty Mango? Yeah. It's the name of the... Pepper? Yes. What is the brand? Oh, it's a... It's a <laughs> How? What? Yeah, I, I, will, I will start recording and give you to smell. To, like, to but what film is your emotions. It's Richard. Yep. Sure you don't. Uh, I know. <laughs> okay. So, this number 10. Number 9. I think last month it was here as well. May, I don't remember. This is Grey Charmel by DDK. Closure. This one is a thick sandalwood with spices and a black tea. This is one. Ah, uh, and the tonka beans. Oh, yeah. Most important thing about this fragrance, it has a tonka beans. So, on a dry down, tonka beans go up, develop, and the fragrance will have this creamy structure, which it don't have right now. I would say this one is like strong, strong black tea. You know, today I, like, I, I can uh, feel in different way the fragrance, you know? Oh, really? Yes, because uh, before I did some videos uh, about the fragrance and I tried. So I felt it like, oh, this is exactly unisex, unisex and maybe more in feminine style. Now I feel like it's for more for men, you know? It's so <laughs> weird because... Yeah, it, that's that's how the weather outside change our perception of the fragrances. That's totally okay. I would say this one is a unisex, slightly on the feminine side. Yeah, I was thinking most, it's like this too. <laughs> yeah, but more more it's unisex one. For lady, I would say I will depict uh, the lady who wear this fragrance like a bossy lady, 
Lady with the Ball. Not, not in Thailand, <laughs> not in Thailand, Lady with the Ball, but the kind of bossy lady. And yeah, uh, I yeah, feel... I can, I can, I cannot say it's date time. Uh, mm -hmm. This one is more universal perfume. It's like this perfume can be in a section of signature scent that you can wear everywhere, mm -hmm. and people will smell you. Like when you come into the room, they will say, "Oh, this is the one." Yeah, our book here. Okay. Here she, here she come. <laughs> yeah. So um, that's so that's that definitely perfume about this. And uh, for any occasion, I would say it's perfect for daytime, for office. For office, when you want to have the structure to your, to when you want to add some structure to your outfit and give this message that you are kind of boss here. But yeah. without being, being too, like, you know, like some bosses, they wear fragrance that you can smell like three floors away. But <laughs> this one, no. This one is a mild, but same time, it gives this vibes of something pretty strict. I have a question for you. Yes. What is a good family? Aromatic. Aromatic? Hey, it's more spicy one. I can't understand, you know. Inside? Mm -hmm. Fig, spices, sandalwood. The saltiness comes from sandalwood here. Also, black tea and tonka beans. Such an interesting fragrance. Yeah, this yeah. one is a... And, and for season, you know, I don't know, if someone wears this fragrance during the summer, just let us know in comments. In my opinion, that's perfect. The perfect season for that fragrance is uh, starting from the fall, goes to, to spring. I'm not sure about summer, but yeah, I'm not so sure about summer. Right. Some, something, maybe summer for office, uh, but give us your thoughts. I'm kind of curious. I cannot see... Uh, person who wear this fragrance during the summer, during the heat, but spring, fall, winter, it's perfect. Yeah, so number seven. I repeat. <laughs> Cheeky Smile by Jules This Box. is a brand, well, not, 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 not long time ago we received the brand and... Uh, and we sold out, for now, sorry. Every, yeah. Or just Cheeky Smile? No, only Cheeky Smile. Oh, because, so we don't, we don't have it. Yeah, cheeky smile anymore. Uh, we we waiting for restock, and um, we'll get it in two weeks with cheeky smile, and also, bit cafe and um, good morning, mm -hmm. and other two fragrances that we knew for us. So this is like this is like baccarat rouge, but more airy, more light. Like I don't feel the new reading from yeah. baccarat. Yeah. Right. New reading of Baccarat Rouge, more contemporary, more fresh, more summerish. So yeah, that one is pretty amazing one. And, and uh, did you try it? Did you wear it? Huh? Oh, maybe. Ah, oh, okay. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm, 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 I'm still wearing new one from Tedros. <laughs> so I'm sorry. You, you, all are, really, you wear it uh, almost every day? <laughs> we just received it yesterday. Coffee addict? No, no. Coffee addict, no. It's not my style. It's too heavy on coffee. I mean, lemon tar. Are you... Ah! Wearing today and a day before. <laughs> and a day, day before, we tried a lot of new fragrances that we'll receive soon. Ramon Monegal will be there. Ah, you did it this year. <laughs> <laughs> you will smell it. Uh, Richard, and the good news about Mise en Cire. Oh, no, Mise en Cire. Okay. We will have it soon. As I, I know people ask about the this brand. Which one? Uh, I don't remember. <laughs> <laughs> I will not say. Me, 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 see? Me, see? Me, see? Me, see? Me, see? What else about this uh, cheeky smile? Uh, Occasion. Everyday fragrance? Anywhere. Season. Season. Anytime. I think this one is a Baccarat version. Perfect for summer. But any, any, any season will be good. Yeah, our recommendation. <laughs> genderless. Yeah, it's absolutely genderless. It's uh, mild saturated. It's not over. Since it have Ambroxan and since it have Isoya Super, longevity will be everywhere. <laughs> and uh, projection will be everywhere. You just come to the room and everyone knows oh, that you are here. I forgot. Yeah. Sorry, I cut you. This battle, light, in the dark. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. it's fluorescent. 
So I am maybe able to put pictures here. Uh, how it looks like found it from internet. Yeah. So which is it? Number six. Okay. Six. That door is called. Wait, ten, nine, eight, seven. Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> we're bad in counting. Uh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. As someone in it, we, we did a TikTok video when we said like fragrance in three words and every fragrance we yeah. it say yes. four, five, six. And someone commented like, oh, you, 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 you're you really bad, bad in this stuff. <laughs> yep, uh, yeah. popular one. Coffee addict. For Again, in our top 10, for, for sure. anyone who want to smell like coffee. Who love coffee. It's so realistic coffee. I don't know. So My realistic. accountant said she had this fragrance. And she said that when in the morning I don't want to drink coffee, but I want to have this charge of energy from coffee, I just applied this fragrance. Mm -hmm. And I feel myself like I just finished the cup of tea, of a good cup of tea. Oh, tea, coffee, tea, coffee, coffee. <laughs> coffee, tea. And this one is a coffee with... Actually, in the big, when we just received it, month two, two months ago, mm -hmm. but when I smell it, it was cold outside. And for me, it smells like Arabic coffee, not mm -hmm. sweet. But now, for me, it smells more like coffee with caramel. Like, like kind of a lot latte coffee, like cappuccino, something like this, with caramel mm. or something. Okay. But I the... don't feel like really like something like cappuccino because of mink, because I still have the mm. strong uh, coffee scent, and cappuccino usually when you put mink, it becomes the scent. Okay. Become, yeah. okay. Because it's so... But for me, it's, right now, it's like coffee with caramel. It's not yeah. just yeah. pure coffee. Yeah. It's not like something... It's not... Something else. Yeah. yeah. He's what absolutely is? good in uh, realistic fragrances, and uh, lemon tar just <laughs> released. You will see videos. I don't know. It will be. I don't know. By the when before. when you see video, if we still have it in a stock, lemon tar. But you need to try it. Yeah. So, what about this season? Any season? Yeah. It's a good month fragrance, so it's any season. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's a, it's any season for sure. Unisex. Absolutely unisex. Occasion. To, to wake up in the morning. <laughs> to wake up. Um, maybe to spoil yourself. Like uh, sometimes we we just uh, you know um, I caught myself on a on a thought when I when I sit in my car after the long working day I just want something different and um, something is not enough for me uh, like. I'm tired, and at the same time, it, you, you just want to have this explosion of emotions. So that fragrance, I think, will be really good for that one. When you just finish your working day, sit in your car, spray it once, and all your evening you will have this emotions around you, around this coffee, around this caramel, uh, vanilla, and the kind of this rich scent uh, that um, will envelop you. So I think, yeah. Yeah, and I think it, it will give... A lot of energy because coffee it can give you a lot of energy from the morning after long it depends. Warm like, day. Um, I don't have this affection with the coffee I don't drink coffee in general so in my brain there is no connection between coffee and, energy. and uh, like energy I, I don't have this but if your brain have this habit to drink a coffee to wake up that will be definitely compensate the cup of coffee so you can save at least six dollars every day <laughs> on a starbucks coffee or tim hortons i don't know uh, it depends where you're living and then uh, that one is cheaper but smells better and longer than one cup of coffee you can say it louder okay. so let's go to the next one it's six or five six, six. i know it's naxos by sergio and it's like all the time on the top. Yeah, it's, a, it's our time. old body. We need this fragrance every, every month. Yeah, this is such a beautiful scent. Lavender. Lavender. Spices? Spices. What else? It's like a honey. Little, yeah, honey, something like powdery. You, you can feel powdery. from the honey, the structure of honey. In... Um, you know, in my mind, I think that one is not good for summer because of the honey. Honey can be over, like, too much during the summer, mm -hmm. but 
Recently, some customers in our store said that these fragrances, this Texas, will be so good during the summer. Honey goes back and lavender goes up with spices, so it will be like really fresh citrusy fragrance, fresh citrusy with lavender fragrances. So that for them it's perfect one for summer. I don't know. I, you know, I can uh, understand that. If someone uh, wore this fragrance during the summer, please let us know about honey How it works. in the summer. Exactly. Is it works or honey will choke you? I, I don't know. I'm, I'm, I'm in a curious stage. So, occasion? So, occasion? Oh, it's everyday fragrance. Everyday fragrance. Gender? So this one is more masculine, but it's unisex, but more masculine. Slightly more masculine. I see a lot of ladies who like this fragrance as well, and they take it for for them as well. So, group of family? Spices. This one is spicy one. Okay. This is was Nexus, and the next one. Leisure in Paradise oh. by Simone Andrioli. Simone this Andrioli is one. so popular right now. And also... And it all, all the time on the top two. Yep. So popular fragrance and... Um, on the top two, but now it's top, top five. <laughs> I mean top... As well. Top two. Oh, and then two. I don't know. Two. I'm sorry for and my pronunciation. Because we have top ten and top two. <laughs> I mean, like as well. <laughs> so this is the vacation. I'm on the beach with the with the pina colada cocktail in my hand. I relax. I put coconut cream on my uh, body. This is for me absolutely summer fragrance, but I, I understand you can wear it in winter year when you want this uh, white. Yep. Absolutely nice fragrance. Yep. Not Tropical, so something, ananas, uh, coconut, pineapple. Pineapple. Ananas <laughs> <laughs> in French. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> Papaya, 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 yeah. coconut milk uh, with. Uh, I like. Yeah, it's it's really beautiful and all Simon and Jewelry right now. So popular. Extremely popular. Trendy. All of them. Trendy. So gender unisex. Unisex. If you're okay with the uh, with the fruitiness uh, and you um, mm-hmm. absolutely. I can say it's pina colada. For me, pina colada is something more like Fanny Flames from Nishani. And then uh, this one is a fruit cocktail, mm-hmm. like uh, like syrupy fruit cocktail, kind of from the can. You just open it. There's a mix of fruit in the syrup. Okay, so occasion, everyday fragrance, and season. It's occasion when you wanna feel feel <laughs> tropical that you are most delicious person <laughs> in the world. That is your occasion when you wanna feel that you are. The people will look at you, not like smiling at you. They just look at you because you're so yummy. They want to take a bite from you. That's the occasion. Like, so if you want to smell like this, yeah. Okay. Okay. <laughs> family, it's fruity. Fruity. It's definitely um, fruity. Gender unisex. We told about it. Yep. That's it. That's it. Um, Arabian Stonka by Montana. This one is pretty hard to find nowadays, I think. Thing because we received so many calls even from Europe about Arabian Stonka and then, like for me and then like is there any closer place for you from uh, to get the perfume? Just a moment, just no, like not the same. I mean the same. I, I mean the, the, the same family. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the, this fragrance. Yeah, the, in general the family will be the same amber family. Uh, so in general, but that one is a freshie. You can wear it during the heat. You can wear it during the summer. Yes, that one is much more heavier, woody. Uh, so definitely not it a heat wave. Evening. Yeah, definitely it's only evening. Definitely for me, it's a place like a club uh, for dance or something. So it's something really sexy, attractive, um, projecting unisex. Yeah. Oh no! I said like uh, on the summer. No, on the evening. So yeah, it's, it's, it's more cold summer. weather fragrance. Um, yeah. What is what is what is really good in that one is the price tag. So if you compare with other Baccarat style fragrances, that one will be one of the most affordable one. 
160 Canadians, um, 270. Oh. So it's twice. Yeah. So the price tag is for that one is uh, perfect. Like I, I said, as I said, like for Baccarat Rouge, among with uh, Floral Mask by Atar Collection, that one and Floral Mask, they will be two most affordable versions of uh, Baccarat Rouge. But they smell in a different way than Baccarat Rouge. They have, all, in general, the yeah. same amber vibes, and that's all. So the next one will be by Atar ah, Collection, yeah. and it's new in the top. And new in the top, and it's number three by Sales in Less yeah. Chance. And you know why? Because of TikTok. Because of TikTok. It's the same like with uh, Azora. Yep. So it's a second. I think other collection should buy for they should buy TikTok. I don't know. <laughs> Island, private <laughs> island. For so, for this because it's a second fragrance that become hyped on TikTok and it's same for Matar collection. But this one, if I forget the name, oh, Azora. Azora. If Azora, uh, if Azora become popular. In, in English speaking, English speaking right. this one in a Spanish world. So, US, Mexico, Latin America. Even we have orders for that fragrance from, from Spain. Spain. <laughs> yeah, from Spain, from Canada to Spain. Oh my God! And this so, one is yeah. This one is something like spoiled fruity. fruity. Yeah, it's fruity. And, uh, fruity. But like uh, in the beginning, I can feel. Yeah, it's more fruity. Yeah. yeah, yeah. It's a raspberry with a cream and ice cream. So it's a fruity fragrance, but but nothing bad. <laughs> it's just just good, but it's good one. <laughs> yes, it's a good, good fruity fragrance. What you can say? It's what is, what's the season? Summer. Yeah. Oh, you know, winter again. Summer. Any season. Any season. Yes. You, because as you can see, most of the fragrances have this. Have this all season gradation, all gender gradation, but that one will be on the feminine side. Yeah. I, I cannot say yeah, it's, it's unisex. Feminine yeah. It's like a more feminine side. Yeah. For me, it's like a spoiled Arabian princess or kind of dessert, like with raspberry. But no, more like spoiled Arabian princess. Like, I don't want to do that. I need, I need the new helicopter. Yeah. Uh, what else? It's pretty saturated actually, and um, longevity is pretty good there. More, it's extended six hours, so I would say it's decent seven or even like close to eight. And um, yeah, it's fruity as we said. And um, it's occasion, like every day. It's every day every fragrance. Day this one, yeah. If it's you feel like uh, princess, spoiled, spoiled, spoiled princess. Spoiled princess. If so, you wanna feel the spoiled princess, and you wanna call to your daddy and said, <laughs> "Daddy, I need a new Bentley." Sugar daddy. <laughs> it depends. Or Arabian daddy or sugar <laughs> daddy. Any 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 daddy. If you you just can call, apply the fragrance and they call and say I want new, new Bentley or new Birkin bag. So and the next one on the top of the time, Azora yep. from a uh, long time. Yeah. So Azora oh. is usually extremely popular. And even in the store, when the people don't know nothing about the hype. They just come to yeah. try the perfume and they said, oh, it's perfect. It's perfect it's for summer. Peachy, floral, jasmine, mm, something beautiful. that's uh, delicate, floral, that you can wear even on a first date. Like first date, I think it's a perfect one. Because this fragrance just gives the vibe that you are perfect, decent girl. No matter, no matter who you are. Yeah. And you know when you, you want to feel like you are so pretty, nice girl? Yeah. yeah. You can wear it. Because it's, I, I can see the pictures, like, I wear dress and then boy and go outside and I uh, um, wear the fragrance. It's like so light, beautiful uh, girl, I don't know. So if you want to cover your bad habits or bad side of you, <laughs> that's Azora. And, uh, or an opposite. Like, you want to highlight that you are... <laughs> So pretty, like like this one. Like I feel pretty. So, yeah. so they kind of like this. Yeah, yep. That's that's a perfect one. No, it's feminine for sure. It's what you. Think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, what do you think about the season? Yeah, I think the season is spring and summer. Yeah, yeah for that one. Uh, but but you know the hype started <laughs> yes. in December, and uh, like uh, people start buying from December, yeah. and they say like it's perfect fragrance for any time, December, January, February. Yeah, it's like it's already May, May. Because when you like the fragrance, you don't yeah. care what yeah. you need to wear. In general, it doesn't matter. When you like fragrance, you wear the fragrance. 
you don't care about season, gender, saturation, nothing. You just feed yourself with emotion from the fragrance. That you should do. So, everything we yep. family group floral, we said, okay. Yep. And, and the number one for a long time. Number one, number one is Bois Imperial by Essential Parfum. Still controversial, still nothing changed. Recently, I received the. You can't feel? Maybe after it's better. Maybe. Uh, recently, I received the question Was it reformulated? No. I contacted with the brand. They say nothing was changed. Since they are new, they don't do nothing like this. The price tag still really, really affordable. 109 in Canadian dollars. And uh, still, we have it. And soon, they already started changing, you know, they all about ecological things. So, new batches from that brand will be reusable. Oh, soon, yeah. you can unscrew it and buy for yourself 150 ml of refill and, uh, and use it as, as long as you want. Uh, you know, I, I can understand why it's number one for a long time. It's unusual, you know, unusual because you will not find something like this. It's really uh, something interesting and it's like, you know, I can describe it, I can define the words. It's like something from the space, you know, like you are the, in the forest, but in the space. Like Avatar, Avatar something like this, you know, something unusual, so something not realistic because I can catch it, you know, but I like it so much, I feel this vibe, you know. So okay, okay, okay. But I can feel it right now. <laughs> after Azora, I can feel it after Kofi. Oh, because it's new one. Ah. It's not. Oh. Because the bottle was new, ah. so you can feel it. Oh, beautiful one. Beautiful. So it's um, basil with black pepper, guayak wood, fresh, woody, peppery at the mm. same time. You know. We are located in Quebec, it's a province in Canada, and most of the people in Quebec against any perfumery. They say no perfumes in a workspace or something like this, in a bank, in a workspace. It's forbidden to use perfumery. Mm -hmm. But what I can say, when they smell this one, they always say, like, what is this? It smells amazing. It's kind of a magnet. For even even for Quebecers with their sensitive nose. Beautiful. Beautiful. The and the beast move. And the season, I'd say it's um, any season. Any season. Every day any day. gender. Any gender. Any occasion. Uh, extremely saturated, but same time fresh and um, airy. Fresh and airy, mm -hmm. but extremely saturated. Longevity is beast mode. And the group, uh, I would say it's um, it's a woody one, mostly, mostly it's a woody yeah, one. I... Uh, yeah, so so for for the beast mode here, I would say yeah, that one is a beast mode. That one, the those two close to beast yeah. mode. Yeah. Oh, the, this one is a beast mode as well. This one I cannot say beast mode. This is like seven hours, not more. Oh, okay. But this one stays for twelve hours, and oh. that one as well. I can smell it like. Pfft. Even on the second day. No, no. no. Okay. It's uh, 67. What else? What else? Nothing to say. We say Nothing everything. to say. We say, yeah, yeah. We said yeah. everything about this the is... perfumes. It's, it's oh. just our top 10. Buy more. <laughs> Buy more different perfumes. My personal recommendation. Do not follow these fragrances. <laughs> follow your nose. Follow your nose. And, and your heart. <laughs> and your feelings will lead you to the fragrance that Continue yourself. Let continue you in the fragrance and enrich your your style and enrich yourself and give you a boost of energy and then give you a boost of confidence. So but it should be not from the fragrance that other people love. It should be from the fragrance that you love. On this positive note, we will say goodbye. Bye guys. Bye. See you.